It came with the Swift Solutions in uh, Castaway Cove, and I know this is new bounty hunts. Our start them up, the Pirate Gang. Attacking cargo ships. Their crime speed cannot be allowed to continue. Hell, it's time for some children to fuck them up. Starving monster hunter or whatever. Well, I'll worry about that on the go if I see them. For now, let's go to the nice shiny star. Oh, look at sparkly. Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, a cake. Sitting in the fucking jar. Hell yeah, I'll eat that shit. Even if it's hard and stale. <laughs> Lose a fucking tooth over it. Um. Oh yeah, I can't jump down now. Of course not. Take the long way around. Should there be a shortcut jump? That'd be nice. Um, cutscene, I guess? Ho 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 ho! Everyone here is wearing a swimsuit, huh? Yes, I wonder why... I wonder that... No wonder they call it Seaside Paradise in the South. Look, they're not dressed correctly! Oh, it's a kid. Tut, so very disrespectful. Ho <laughs> ho. Huh? Nickers, it's like Ding Dong Dell all over like flipping again. Jeepers. Come on now. What is this disturbance? Ah, Governor, a very person the very person we need. What do we have here? Hmm? You are visitors of uh, to our town, I take it. You must know that all who enter this place are required by law to wear the appropriate attire. I speak of course a bathing suit. That's... that's... that's just fucked up. Why? What, like, you enter this place and you get your... Uh, okay, I, I'm not even gonna read it. Uh... We ain't planning on moving here. We, we ain't planning on moving here. We're just passing through, like. Nonetheless, the law must be obeyed. The dark days of the past cannot be re revis revisited once we have great trouble here. What? I'm sorry to hear that. Oh, that's Oliver. I'm getting... I need to get into it. <sighs> okay. You'd never think to look at the lawn... Uh, never look at this place now. It's so peaceful. It was a time of great sadness. Travelers all over would sail to Castaway Cove. Travelers who would... who do not always see eye to eye. The men of the sea are hearty, but quick-tempered, without... Cons Without constant supervision, they would soon fall upon, they'd soon fall upon one another in anger. And for this reason, I deserved a, I devised a means of maintaining the peace. Wearing a swimsuit? I am sure you have guessed already what it was. A stupid law that should not exist. <laughs> so what's the punishment if you're not wearing it? Beheading? Cutting off of the wrists? Yes, to require all those in the town wearing raven suits, of course. What is he? Flipping cracker? <laughs> flipping crackers or something? What does that mean? Oh, a bunch of white people crackers. Uh, what difference would th the, would that make? A great difference indeed, fairy. Hi, he knows he's a fairy. For a bathing suit, one cannot counsel, conceal a weapon. Ho ho ho! Well, okay, that makes sense, I guess, but let's... Wait still kind of silly. Wait, that lady over there is wearing some sort of a toga. That's not a swimsuit. Why don't you find her? <laughs> Anyways, no matter the homeland yet. Be there at the moon from Ding Dong Dell or the furthest thing in the islands in the north. They don the bathing suit. They become citizens of Castaway Cove. Wow, that's interesting. But it's such a strange idea. How do you convince everyone to agree? Haha, <laughs> brainwashing, of course. <laughs> or, I use Ron Howard. I'm Ron Howard. <laughs> right, anyways, ho ho ho. At first, of course, I met the ridicule of all sides. None would support my scheme. My evil harebrained scheme. But I do not, but I do not waver, reminding my vision of frustration. Uh, something about uh, fucking peace in the world and uh, that love and peace, yeah. Whatever. Gee, I thought it was. I thought they were dressed like that because it was so hot. <laughs> Me too. Ho 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 ho, you stupid children. Wear a bathing suit or we'll behead you. Anyways, such a misunderstanding is a happy one, okay? I understand now. We should go in the governor's wishes and dress like everybody else. 
Let's do it. I want to become a citizen of Castaway Cove. All right then. We are flip. If we flip it, must. But uh, I ain't got a swimsuit, have you? Ho ho ho! Worry not, little one. We have a great wealth of a uh, great wealth of bathing suits prepared for visitors such as yourselves. Come, uh, follow me to my home. Uh oh, this is gonna be dark and disturbing. Oh there. Check me out, dolly boy. I look the business in this little number. Huh? Oh, Where did you get the little that? suit for him? <laughs> I th upside down. What do you think? Hmm? Duh. bait Oh wait, enemies. Sorry, I'm late. We may be boys, but we ain't entirely ignorant of more involved creature nature of fe feminine dress. Whatever you say. <laughs> uh, I guess. Anyway, we're all citizens of Castaway Cove now. Let's go look around. Take a look around. Thank you very much, Mr. Governor Sir. Ho ho ho! Bringing a game to a screeching halt is my pleasure! Anyways, the bathing suits are yours now. You must wear them whenever you visit us. At least... At last, I can say to you, welcome to Castaway Cove. Thank you. <laughs> and now we can go to uh, the flipping boat and talk about the, yeah, that okay, bathing suit. Yeah. Thanks for that. Now I'm, now I'm in shorts. I guess Esther is too. I can kind of see it. And her portrait. I'm a shirtless boy. Ho, ho, ho. Excuse me, sir. Are you the captain of this ship? I am, lad. Captain and master of all who sail in her. You have a beautiful boat, captain. You do not need to tell me that. She is the most beautiful on the seven seas. There is not a finer, a finer or more fearsome ship afloat. And her name is no no less no less fine and fearsome oh, for the for the legendary sea cow sea cow that's a fearsome legend legendary sea cow come up with a better name I could have came up with one jeez I'll call it Excalibur or, or sea blazer or something I don't know something fucking better than sea cow I have something to ask you captain would you let us ride aboard your ship hmm you seek passage aboard the sea cow? Oh, 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 fucking sea cow. We need to get to Anamana. Avast, girl. I believe you can you can merely stroll aboard. Who do you think you are? Well, Captain, I'm... Well, Captain, I must say, have a fine... What a fine Captain you are. Brown nosing. Brown lanterning. I guess it would be for him. A young man standing before you. And I know it seems unlikely. But bear with me. This un un unassuming scrap of a lad here, Oliver, his name is... Oliver, his name is... Oh, sorry. He is on a journey to save the flippin' world. You know, just a little bit of a world-saving quest, that's all. You know, like every guy goes through in this adventure. Anyways, uh, 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 hi, Lord of the Fairies. Oh. oh, and I'm Esther. I'm not really relevant to this quest. I'm just a... Tamer. I'm actually, I'm really important, actually. You are a fairy? I have traveled... I have traveled the world, and I've never seen one of your kind before. So, lad, you travel to see... You travel to save the world with a fairy for a companion? Ha 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 ha! Then surely my ship alone would not suffice. You will need two ships. A fleet, even. Ha ha ha. Uh, does that mean we can ride with you? But of course, boy, just as soon as you have shown me the letter of passage from the beloved Calypia, the most exalted lofa? What the fuck? We sail, after all, for, for her glory, and for that of Alma Moon. Should the, should the Calypia see fit and permission to come aboard, you will refuse. Oh, Alma Moon? We're gonna go back to Alma Moon. Alright, Captain, we'll go get the letter right now. <laughs> Fine words, lad, but easier said than done, I fear. Still, if you are truly this, truly to save the world, it should be the work of of mere moments or whatever. Ha ha ha! I don't think he believes us, does he? 
I don't think he believes us, does he? I like how if Drippy's squinting. Keep an eye on that guy, he's hilarious. Anyways, it doesn't matter. We have to go, we have to prove him wrong. If we can bring him a letter of passage, well, he'll have to believe us. Let's go back to Alma Moon and get it. Califia Lola, whatever the fuck this. I wonder what she's like. Looking forward to this, I am flippin' love royalty me. Okay. <sighs> so I have to travel back. Oh yeah, I'm gonna show my monsters. He's got eyes. The eyes. Finally replaced, uh, what's his name? Uh, what is it? I've already fried his name. Oh, he's down there, mighty. At least for now. I want to see how he works. Fortunately, he doesn't really block, but... Eh, I can always pull him back and block with Oliver if I have to. 